anyone out there is yours truly, Dave. Dave, what's up? What's up? I want to talk about missing 411. These are kids that are missing in the parks, national parks around this world. Well, Sammy Sam, uh, national parks, these are kids that are going missing in national parks around our world. Uh, United States and Canada. These are kids that have gone missing in parks, in national parks. Uh, big parks. I mean, these are national parks. These are big national parks around the world. And so I'm going to say, is this the missing 411? Uh, these are people who have gone, and kids gone missing. And I want to exploit this. I want to exploit this to, uh, to the highest degree. I want to exploit this. Um, kids are going missing in national parks everywhere on this planet. And it's, it's why that's called the Missing 411, about kids gone missing in national parks. For whatever reason, they gone missing. And it's either by UFO, it could be uh, by uh, uh, portals, it could mean all sorts of things. But kids have gone missing in national parks around our world. Um, the, the, the years that kids have gone missing in national parks are from the 70s, 80s, and 90s, and beyond. Uh, when people go to uh, parks, big, huge parks, kids utterly go missing. Uh, I don't know why, but there's a movie out there called Missing 411 with kids that have gone missing in national parks. For some other reason, the park rangers don't know what had happened, why they gone missing, and they don't keep a list. They don't keep a list of people gone missing in national parks around our planet, uh, around the world. So I'm going to call this the Missing 411 for a reason, because kids are going missing, children gone missing, Kids gone missing, uh, adults has gone missing, people have gone missing in national parks. That's national parks, folks. And uh, I want to I want to expose this. I want to really expose this and debunk it. Um, these are park rangers that don't have a list of people who gone missing in national parks, big national parks around our world, in the United States and Canada. Uh, so I would exploit this. The, to the further degree, um, I want to give this option to the viewers out there. So these are people have gone missing. Children have gone missing in national parks. The 411, and I want to exploit this and give the recognition that Rutley deserves. There was a guy on last night who was uh, was on Coast to Coast with George Norrie, and he was talking about the missing 411. He had a movie out. He had one movie and another movie. And it spawned some ideas, but never some leads. There was never no leads. So the uh, so he came out with a book called Missing 411. There's a hat about it. You can wear a hat called Missing 411. These are just people gone missing in parks, like national parks. These are natural parks. And the park rangers have no idea where this list is. People have gone missing in national parks. For whatever reason, uh, they gone missing. And I uh, want to really exploit this, really exploit this to the further degree and put a title on this. So there you go, folks. That's my story. And